21 for L, ain't no way I'm gonna switch. Uh, let me get two McDoubles and one hot and spicy. Two McDoubles and one hot and spicy. Yeah, and a large Diet Coke. That'll be out for you. Yeah, yeah. All right, that's how it's gonna be. Six hundred one. All right. What's going on, guys? I wrote a statement and that really me up. My brother lost his life and it turned me to a beast. My brother. All right, just give me a minute, guys. Hold on. I'm trying to turn. I've been through the storm. What's going on, guys? It's your boy Tony. Welcome back to the channel, guys. Usos out of detailing, guys. It's another grind day, guys. Uh, today I'll be just working on my client house. Now <clears throat> I didn't have time to hook up my trailer, guys, because I've been doing bouncers and all the things. So I just got the basics. Uh, you know, I always borrow their water and their uh light. So you know that kind of saves me a little money with my clients. Um. Uh, but let's talk about, you know, don't don't lower your prices down just because someone says, oh, well, I know somebody that can do it cheaper. <laughs> you know, I get that a lot of guys. I get it a lot of guys. I get it. A lot of people tell me, hey, well, um, I know this guy who does it cheaper. So, you know, my work speaks for itself. You get what you pay for. You know what I'm saying? You want cheap work, you're going to get cheap work. But I'm not just any kind of auto detailer, guys. I take my business serious, you know. I have, I take I take it to the pride, you know. So if I tell you my price is this, I'm going to show you that you're going to get some love, you know. Uh, but never, never lower your prices down, guys, unless you don't have no clientele. Then that's, that's the only hard part where you really going to have to, you know, charge less. But... If you already have clientele, why try to get go from from a, a good pro from your good prices and just trying to get go lower? You know, just because I'm trying to compare you. Hold up, I ain't even got my money ready. Yeah. All right. All right. Appreciate it. Thank you. I'm dropping all my money. All right. But uh, hold up, guys. I can't even multitask right now. I'm dropping everything. Hold up, guys. Hold up. Hello, sir. Hey. How are you? Good, good. You All right. Yeah. Thank you. You come back to All right. All right. All right. I'm dropping everything, guys. Hold up, guys. I'm dropping my license, money. Oh my! Every I'm dropping everything today, guys. I just hope I don't lose anything. Ooh, I almost hit the curve. Yeah, guys. So I'm heading to uh, my client house right now. Oh, uh, I'm supposed to be doing a uh, full detail. That's what he wants. He wants wax job on the boat. So I'll be making 125 dollars. That's what I normally charge for a car. <clears throat> uh my prices are still not that. Hi guys, I'm still kind of, I'm still considered cheap from what other people have already told me, but uh, I mean that's better than what I was doing last year. Last year I was doing the wax jobs for only 85 bucks, and uh, then the wax with polish was the 105, I think. Yeah, so I went up just a little bit, guys, but I'm constantly picking up and picking up clientele, you know. But, uh, you know, don't waste your time with cheap customers, guys. Don't waste your time. You know, if you know your work is that valuable, it's worth it, then why why should you try to take the job just because the person wants, don't want to pay that much? I really want to give them all... All they, if you do accept the job, I just won't give them all all that work. You know, I will give them some cleaning and all that, but mm -mm, that's just you're doing too much, guys, for little money, guys. You know, so uh, 
Don't play with your prices, guys. Don't play with your prices. Keep doing your thing. People eventually going to see your work. Clients and the new customers, they're going to be starting to, they're going to start to recommend you. Uh, it, it's That's how it works, you know. <clears throat> uh, so far, I don't even advertise no more, guys. You know, most people know what I'm saying. When I go, when I check my Facebook, some people are already tagging me on their uh, on the Facebook groups. Like when when they people looking for like uh, auto detailer, they tag me in there. But then you got all these other people <clears throat> who are not really into the detailing game, but they always come in and they're like, I can do it for cheaper. And you know, that's what really put me out of the game. But uh. Well, put me out of the list on that group. Because I'm not going to do it for cheap, guys. I'm not. You know, I let my word speak for itself. So, you know, my clients and my new customers, they know it. So, it is what it is, guys. But, um, don't want to make the video too long, guys. I just want to tell you guys, don't, don't bring your prices down. Don't waste your time with cheap people, guys. Don't waste your time. There's plenty of work to do. There's people out there that are looking for a good detailer. And if you consider one, if you consider yourself a good detailer with the passion, then you know, just hold on tight. You will find somebody who really gonna uh, stick with you, you know, and that person's gonna bring you clientele. But uh, that's going to wrap it up for this video, guys. Y'all keep grinding. Stay positive, guys. And as always, stay hustling, guys. I'll see you in the next video, guys. I'm going to go get this money. So, deuces. Y'all be safe.